What is that? This might be a kind of a weird call, but did you happen to lose a phone recently? Yes, I actually did. Hey guys, I was able to get in touch with the owner and get them back their bag full of stuff. I can't believe you found it. Oh, oh my God. Like it? <laughs> That's it. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Hey, what's going on guys? Adam Brown Adventures here. I'm out at the river today and I'm out joined by my buddy Zach. And uh, he does diving videos as well. You can check out his YouTube channel below. We are out here at this beautiful river. This is my main spot I usually come out here. We are looking for any type of stuff that people lose. And uh, hopefully we can return them, that, anything that we can find like phones or cameras back to them if we can identify the owners. So stay tuned to the end of the video to see all the stuff we find. But it's a beautiful day, guys. There's tons of people out here. And uh, I think we're gonna do pretty good. Are you excited? Man, I'm, I'm ready. Let's do this. This water feels amazing. Awesome. Let's get to it, guys. Oh, yeah. What's going on? I don't know. There might be a cell phone in there though. Did you lose one? Like three people have told me they've lost them out here. <laughs> Found something. A bag of a... Uh, Somebody's lost stuff. <laughs> Is that full of bones? It might be. I couldn't get you. I was like, good God, I have to go back around. I'm about to go on the shore and check it out. Definitely looks like a bag full of... Looks like a speaker. Waterproof stuff. There's water in there, though. <laughs> we'll see if it's waterproof. Sunscreen. That looks like a phone. Yeah, there's definitely a phone in there. Yeah, let's go check this out. So you guys lost a bag? We did. We did. <laughs> we right that. I can't believe you found it. Oh, oh my god. we like it? <laughs> That's I, it. it. It was clear, I swear. <laughs> Hold on to your stuff down there. Let's go try to sneak up on this turtle, guys.
to hold on to your stuff on this rabbits. Especially your phones. <laughs> This is not really an easy way. I just go down on my back, you know, feet first. I usually end up getting a little scratched up, but. I was gonna ask, how do you feet not, or not get scratched up? I just get scratched <laughs> <laughs> I just do. But, I don't know. I guess in my old age, I'm just getting a little, you know, insane. <laughs> Found a ring, but it's not. Uh -huh. I was like, yeah. Did you find a ring out here? Uh, I found a gold ring up there before. Nice. A white gold wedding band. Now I'm looking for stuff people lose. No, people drop stuff. Cell phones, sunglasses. Uh, I've been out here, I dive all the time out here. I found so many iPhones, you wouldn't believe. All right, guys, that is the end of the video today. I had a blast out diving with my buddy Zach. What'd you think of the day so far? Man, it was awesome. The water was nice and refreshing. It was cold. Uh, it was, you know, it, it's warm outside. So as soon as I got in the water, I was freezing cold. But man, once you got acclimated to the water, I uh, had a blast. The current was a lot stronger than I expected though. I mean, I, from your videos, you, you, you just look like it's so, you make it so easy going in and out of that current. And as soon as I got in there, I felt like I was in a washing machine. <laughs> I was just getting thrown around at those rocks, but man, I had a blast. I appreciate you letting me come out with you. Yeah, man, yeah, those, current are, those currents are no joke, guys. You may not be able to tell from my videos, but they are strong and powerful and you'll get sucked down river before you know it. So you really gotta be careful if you're doing this, but it was a really great day. Let me show you guys what we got today. I got um, a bunch of trash, which I'll be able to throw away and uh, some random pieces of rope, fishing pole. Got a few sunglasses. I think this is, I think you found this too. So I found that, funny story about that. I actually found it. I picked it up and I was looking at it. I was like, what is this? And then that was one of the moments I got sucked down the river and I lost it. <laughs> Yeah, so I think that's uh, some type of sensor or light. You guys let me know in the comments. I'm not entirely sure. It says Jaguar on it. I don't know. <laughs> I thought it was an aerator at first. Maybe it goes but... to a car. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> so I found a few things I thought were a ring, but they are not. Found a little vape. Golf ball, as always. And the best find of the day is this mystery bag. And uh, I'm about to dump this out for you guys. I hadn't really looked at it yet. So let's see what we got. Oh, oh yeah, got a bunch of stuff. Wow. Oh dang. Wait, let's start over here. We got a Bose speaker, which I don't think is waterproof. It doesn't look like one, so that's probably trash. I mean, this stuff looks like it's been in here a while. There's three sets of car keys that are starting to rust. This person was not happy when no, <laughs> someone had a bad day. Someone had a bad day. <laughs> you should never trust one person with all your stuff. But we got, uh, we got a wallet here, and it's got somebody's ID in there, so we'll definitely be able to get back that, that back to the owner. It's someone else's ID here, and a little vape pen of some sort, and then three phones. It looks like three iPhones, so that is awesome. The waterproof bag really didn't work, did it? Yeah, I don't, I don't think that bag was too <laughs> But that is awesome, guys. Did a pretty good, pretty good day today. I mean, I found that in the first 10 minutes, and then I ended up not really finding much else the rest of the day, but sometimes it's like that, so... Yeah. All right guys, so I'm about to contact the owner of this bag that I found in the river to see if I can get that returned to them. And I was going through the bag and I actually found a few extra things that I'm sure they'll definitely be happy to get back. Check it out. So I found his wallet and uh, it turned out he had a hundred dollar bill in there. So that'll definitely be nice. I mean, he's got all his IDs and a bunch of stuff in there, um, which is always annoying to you know get reissued and all that. 
And then behind this other iPhone case, there was $40 back behind that. So that's really cool. Unfortunately, this iPhone does not turn on. These two do, um, but that was really cool. So I'm sure he'll be, they'll be extra happy to get all their stuff back. Guys, yeah, so I'm gonna try to call the owner of this phone first, and hopefully he picks up. Let's give him a call. Hello. My name's Adam Brown. This might be a kind of a weird call, but I was uh, diving in the river uh, like a week ago and I found a, a bag full of cell phones and other stuff. Did you happen to lose a phone recently? Um, yes, I actually did. <laughs> that is wild. How's it going? <laughs> pretty good, pretty good. So you guys lost a bag? We did. We did. <laughs> we were out I can't believe you found it. Oh, oh my like it? That's I, it. It was clear, I swear. Yeah. This was 100%. Yeah. That's McHugh. Yep. McHugh right there. Oh my lord. I wonder if the speaker still works. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. It wasn't a waterproof one? I'm supposed to. Yeah, it's supposed, supposed to be. It might. I don't know. I didn't try turning it on, but yeah. uh, I got that's you. crazy. Oh my god. Thanks again. Hey guys, I was able to get in touch with the owner and get them back their bag full of stuff. And uh, I'd love to know <laughs> what exactly happened. How'd you guys lose? this bag with all your phones and keys and everything in it. All right, so uh, yeah. <laughs> we decided it would be a good idea to go kayak the Saluda River. From the dam all the way into Columbia. Oh, really? <laughs> with uh, no experience whatsoever, at least for Except me. Except for me. <laughs> <laughs> I had a whitewater kayak and they just had open top kayaks. And so. I was the one with the bag. They both went down and they both made it. And I was like, all right, like I guess I'll be fine. <laughs> and so I went down, literally like not even halfway down, flipped. And it was just gone. Like, I, I literally yeah. couldn't even see it. So they, they trusted you with all the stuff? Everything. Yeah. Everything. It wasn't a smart choice. <laughs> yeah. Even though he had the closed kayak. But, but the, we wanted know, to hear the speakers. So. That's true. It was a selfish decision. But yeah. How long ago did you lose? How long was it in the water for? Probably this has like probably been there at least a month. A month? Probably closer to a month and a half. And a half. <laughs> yeah. yeah. It's been a while. It's been in there for a little bit. We've all we, got all the replacement stuff. stuff. So. Just got your ID pretty recently. Yeah, <laughs> I got my idea like two weeks ago. That's crazy. I'm glad I could get it back to you guys. Yeah, and, uh, thank it's always, you so much. It's always cool thank to return you, yeah. the stuff you the owner. Yeah, so. It is. Uh, you don't yeah. lose that stuff again. Thank you so much. Yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you subscribe to both our channels. Leave a comment, leave a like, and I'll see you all in the next adventure. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah.